Hey, James Arndt here. I've got uh, a couple of marshmallow techniques to show you. As you've, as you've been seeing on Pampton today, uh, we've been having a marshmallow skins contest. And in case you don't know what that is, that's um, basically what we do is we roast the marshmallows, which are these giant, giant marshmallows. And um, we toast them a bit and take the outer skin off without taking off the rest of the marshmallow. And just for kicks, we've uh, been counting how many we can do, how many skins we can get out of one marshmallow. And the new record is seven skins. I just set that one about half an hour ago. So um, I'll give you a bit of a demonstration of what a marshmallow skin is and give you an idea of how we do it. So. First of all, you gotta get a good flame here. And I don't, I don't for the purposes of the skin, I don't get it roasting too much. I try to just get it to catch fire pretty quickly. This kind of singe the outer layer. There we go, that's one side. Just a little more here. That should be enough for the first skin. And then... Harden the outer layer a bit. And then you could peel off a marshmallow skin. You can see it's a hollow shell of a marshmallow. And I'm just gonna set this one aside for demonstration purposes. So I cool this one off a bit. And normally if I were, like when I was, went for the record here, I uh, took a minute or two break in between each one to let the marshmallow cool, uh, cool down. Um, but, you know, so I'm not taking, I'm trying to make the skins as thin as possible so I can get as many as I can out of it. Um, but for, for this, I'll just uh, go right into the second skin and show you how that is. Okay, as you can see, I just gave it as little bit of a toasting as I could. I just lightly toasted, just enough to harden the outside. Okay, and there's another skin. <laughs> so as you can see, this is the process we take. Um, we uh, reheat this marshmallow over and over and just get as many skins as we can out of it. And uh, this is the my special marshmallow roasting stick that I made earlier today. It um, greatly surpasses Jacob's marshmallow stick, which he sits destroying food to this very fire. So, um, I guess that's about it. Um, more info on the marshmallow contest or future records being set. Uh, stay tuned to Pampton today.